In this video, I'll demonstrate our kitting application, which allows you to pick and place multiple objects by taking a picture. This is the Quick Pick Kitting Demo. The user would use the Run screen, and they would select the quantity of the different objects that they would want to pick. To configure kitting, press the Configure tab. Initially, the objects are just called Object 1 through 4. There is no picture to select, and the dimensions aren't set, and the pick and place zones aren't set. We'll configure our first object, which I'll call KitKat. I click in the box and then type the name, like so. I'll set the KitKat under the camera. In the kitting application, click Set Pick Picture, and you'll see this screen. Use your mouse to outline the object. It shows up in green. Press OK to approve. The image of the object shows up here. There are many ways to use Quick Pick, but it's the most accurate when it knows the size of the object. Measure the physical size of the picture that you took, in this case, 80 by 60 millimeters. Measure the thickness of the object, 10 millimeters. Enter them into the kitting application, 80 by 60 by 10. When placing multiple objects, the kitting application uses the thickness to know how to stack them. Set the pick zone by pressing this button, then you can free drive the robot to a location. Then press the set button again to lock in that location. Press the test button in order to move to the pick zone and see the object in the field of view. Here is the found object. It will detect all objects in the field of view. Set the place zone by pressing the set button and free drive the robot to where you want it to go. Free drive the robot to the table surface, which is where it will start placing, like this. Press the set button to lock in that location. Press save to save your work. Click on the run screen to try the pick and place. Choose the quantity, we'll choose three Kit Kats. Then press go. We perform this visual pick and place operation without any programming. I continued the configuration of the kitting application by teaching it Reese's, Hershey's, and Skittles. Now I'll set up a trick or treat pick and place scene. How about a shelf to pick off of, Reese's peanut butter cups, Hershey's. Skittles, and some Kit Kats. Lastly, our plate to put it on. This is the candy picking scene. Our first pick will be one of each a Kit Kat, Reese's, Hershey's, and Skittles. Then we press go to start. Now we'll choose three Kit Kats and three Reese's and one of the Hershey's and Skittles. And press go to start.
Now you've seen how easy it is to use our kitting application to pick and place multiple objects based on their picture.